This is one way in which you can calculate the highest common factor, HCF, and lowest common multiple, LCM, of a pair of numbers. Let's start with an example. So we're going to find the highest common factor and the lowest common multiple of 30 and 42. So you write the numbers next to each other like this and draw a line down the side. We think about a number that divides into both 30 and 42, i.e. any factor of 30 and 42. 2 is an example. Now we know that 2 multiplies by 15 to make 30 and 2 multiplies by 21 to make 42. We now consider 15 and 21 and think about any common factors of 15 and 21. They're both divisible by 3, so I write 3 here. And I can fill in underneath that 3 multiplied by 5 makes 15, 3 multiplied by 7 makes 21. At this point, I have to stop because 5 and 7 have no common factors other than 1, which isn't um, useful to us. I draw this line in here. Then to calculate the highest common factor, we multiply the 2 by the 3, i.e. the numbers in the vertical column. To calculate the lowest common multiple, think of L, think of an L shape, we need to multiply the 2 by the 3 by the 5 by the 7. This gives us an answer of 210. Let's look at another example. We're going to calculate the highest common factor and lowest common multiple of 180 and 330. So we write the numbers next to each other, 180, 330, and draw in this line here. Now, um, 180 and 330 have a number of different common factors. Um, 10 could be a starting point, which would allow us to write 18 and 33 here. We then think about common factors of 18 and 33. 3 is an obvious common factor, which gives us a 6 and an 11. And at this point, we have to stop because 6 and 11 do not have any further common factors. Drawing in this line here to rule off. Then the HCF is equal to 10 multiplied by 3, which is 30. And the LCM, draw in that L shape, is 10 multiplied by 3, multiplied by 6, multiplied by 11, which is 1980.